it's Tuesday, August 26, 2008. I'm John Pachkowski, and this is Digital Daily. Apple's iPhone 3G is selling well overseas, despite some activation and delivery problems. In fact, Deutsche Telekom's wireless division, T-Mobile, has sold 120,000 of the device since it arrived at market on July 11th. Our sales expectations were surpassed, said T-Mobile International CEO Hamid Akaban. News of iPhone 3G's warm reception in some parts of Europe comes amid reports that Apple is finalizing a deal that will bring the device to Russia. In Russia, iPhone buys you. Anybody know how well Amazon's Kindle ebook reader is doing? I mean, really doing? Well, according to Citigroup's Mark Mahaney, whose analytical prowess enables him to extrapolate sales figures from his, you know, the device is doing quite well. So well, in fact, Mahaney sees Amazon selling 380,000 Kindles this year to become the iPod of the book world. But according to McAdams' right Reagan analyst, Tim Buenaman, who's actually, you know, spoken with some Amazon officials, the device might not be selling as well as Mahaney claims. Said Buenaman, Amazon told us that the Kindle is definitely selling well, but they also said that analysts and reporters giving out these extremely high estimates, quote, did not run them by the company. Extremely high estimates? Sounds like Amazon's trying to temper expectations, doesn't it? Hewlett Packard has wrapped up its acquisition of technology services giant Electronic Data Systems, the company's largest purchase since the $20 billion merger former HP CEO Carly Fiorina orchestrated with Compaq six years ago. Thankfully, this one wasn't nearly as rancorous. Valued at $13.9 billion when it was first announced, the deal will more than double the size of HP's consulting and outsourcing business. And it'll likely do the same to the $16.6 billion in revenue from services the company made in 2007. So when the dust has settled around the merger, HP will be the second largest provider of consulting and outsourcing services behind IBM. Sure, it'll take a hell of a lot of integration work to get there, but if HP manages to pull it off, well, as Fiorina would likely tell you, bigger is better if you can do it right. That's it for Digital Daily. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again tomorrow.